Hello and welcome to Landria Anka on YouTube. Here to help you break through fears, to go after your awesome life, and really, you know, just sort of recognize that the only thing stopping you from getting to that ideal life is you. That's what I want to talk about in this video. The only barriers are those that you are creating. Yes, they are based on conditioning, things you've been told, contributions by other people. But here's the wonderful part about this life that we came into. We get choice. Now, some of these choices were made in advance. We don't always recognize them because everything has been wiped out because if we knew everything in advance, this wouldn't be the adventure that it is, right? It's the challenges we took on to experience. You are part of God. You're part of one energy that is experiencing all of these wonderful feelings and challenges and breakthroughs and joy. You know, you can live in that state every day. If nothing changed around you, if you could change just the way you viewed the world and how you felt and connected to the one source, all of these things around you would not bother you. Yes, you would have feelings, you would experience some highs and lows, but they would no longer rule you and there would still be a joy deep inside of you that would always be there that told you, guess what, this too shall pass and that there are always more beautiful, brighter things on their way. And also, this is all temporary and what you accomplish here is so important. Don't miss that. A lot of people, they just sort of function. They just let life take them wherever it does, and they never stop and take control of that because they don't recognize they really are in control. You know, they think that life is happening to them when they're actually creating that reality. So I'm here to tell you, you really do have that power. So, you know, the biggest question everybody has is, well, how do I do it? How do I get there? How do I get rid of these thoughts? I have many, many videos on that. There's about 400 and climbing that you can choose from about any subject that you're dealing with, from letting go of all of the stuff your parents and your family conditioned you with, to letting that go and releasing it and understanding that those lessons served a purpose for you. Maybe you were the higher vibrational being that came into that family and you took that on because you were capable. There's always somebody in the family that's stronger or clearer or able to, you know, get through, uh, you know, challenges much easier than other people. That's the leader. That's the person that can help elevate those around them. Maybe they'll learn something from you. But nothing will happen in a positive manner if you don't elevate yourself and break through and recognize that all those things served a very positive purpose and that you chose those circumstances, those players. This is a play. This is a very dense planet. It's the master class. You chose to take it on. Yahoo! You're a warrior. Now some people, they bug out. They get here and they just, they're not up for it. A lot of people have been leaving the last couple years, I've noticed, because we're going into the major transition. So my next video is going to be about all the effects that are happening from that because we're all feeling it on some level, some more than others. So I just want to share with you today that, you know, no matter what's happening in your life, no matter what you're feeling, you have control at every moment. And you can decide what your thoughts are, what your actions are. And no matter what you're feeling, you can change that. You know, it's, it's garbage day, sorry. You can change anything, no matter what your circumstances are. No matter what your circumstances are. That external is not the real world. Yes, it's real to you in this scenario you're playing out, but truly, if you change the way you think and what you connect to, all of that can change and you can just as easily create a new reality. We're all living in different realities. Mine 
may be completely different than yours, yet we're on the same planet. There's so much more to this than we know. The different dimensions, the different frequencies, everything's energy and everything is possible. But I'm here to tell you, you are in control. When you take responsibility for that, you will realize that you wield so much power that this reality that you have right now can change in an instant. One phone call, one kind gesture, one you know, healing, whatever it is, it can change, but only if you have the faith and really truly believe that you do have that power and that you are in the driver's seat every moment. Anything that intervenes is because you've requested it, you've opened up to it. It never comes in without your permission unless you are on a lower level vibration and then you're opening up the gateway to some nasty stuff that's vibrating on your level and you're inviting that in too. It may seem like you're not doing it, but you really are. So get out of that. Get out of that low level. You're going to start attracting the other stuff that's connecting to you that's negative because it's like, oh, you know, this person is like calling me. I'm going to come over there and visit. The negative energies, the negative people, the negative situations. Like I said, there's always opportunities coming to you, but are they the same ones you keep taking over and over again? Hey, here's another position. Maybe it's the same kind of boss, the same kind of low pay, the same long hours. It's because you're not raising the vibration. You're not saying no to that and saying yes to this. You're in control. Start doing it today. No excuses. What are you going to do today to change the patterns, the situation you're in that you don't want, want that you don't love? Meditate. Ask for the guidance. Ask for the help. It's there for you because we're all one. We all share the collective consciousness and every answer is there waiting for you. You've got to clear out the clutter. Release all the negativity. Forgive those who have done things that have been hurtful. But again, you chose those positions and the, your ability to forgive them for being human. That's that dense side. That's not really us. They're connected to that. Forgive them for that. Forgive them for not being connected to their one light beingness that they are. But you are. You are. You're a seeker and you're on your way to awakening right now. And all good things are going to come to you. Namaste.